night I was on my YouTube channel this morning and I noticed all over the place people were pointing out that we lost more than 15,000 subscribers last night. Now again, I don't even really promote this YouTube channel. I never even tell people on the radio, go subscribe. This was a fan YouTube set up a few years ago that got like, I don't know, 50 million views or something. So we kind of took it over uh, with the activist that was running it. We've got more than eight channels, uh, a total of 400 million views on YouTube in the last few years. This channel has um, a whole bunch of views. We'll show you that number in a minute. And I know that they're making all these changes. In fact, I even told some of the guys last week, I said, get screenshots of our subscribers and numbers. I haven't gotten into work yet to find out if they did do that. But, I mean, everybody saw that we had over 250,000 subscribers. So uh, uh, there's the comment on this video. Top foundations fund eugenics programs. By the way, that's a very important report. But let's just go to the Alex Jones channel here. Okay. I hit pause on that new video, that satire video I did that we put up last night, America, Land of the Snitch. And you scroll down here. That's weird. Our profile image is broken. You scroll down here, and it says this channel's had 36 million views. And total upload views are 177,678,076. And then you see subscribers. 235,000. I mean, just last week I looked at the number and it was like 253,000. I know it was over 250, as, as the readers are pointing out. I started seeing this all over comments and I didn't even really believe it at first. And I saw like the third comment and I went and looked it up and there goes at least 15,000 subscribers. Boom. And then I was doing some more looking. Everybody's reporting this. It's not just our channel. And everybody's constantly complaining that they don't get our videos, but they get the big partner videos. You know, isn't it funny that Google that owns YouTube has delisted us from Google News, from the News tab? Isn't it funny that uh, all of this is going on and that now people are telling us that they're being kicked off their subscriptions? Because um, we're also getting those reports, you know, that, hey, I didn't unsubscribe and it's gone. And... They're also telling us that there's all sorts of other censorship taking place. There's our new video, America, Land of the Stench. It's really funny, but also sadly true, so go check that out. But everybody, uh, let's do a test today. I'm going to tell my radio audience and all the folks on YouTube, uh, subscribe or comment under this video whether or not you've been unsubscribed without trying to or what other uh, chicanery and scams you've seen. And, of course, their new terms of service say they can use all your data on you, share it with anybody, that you have no privacy, that they own your videos. I mean, Google is, has always been evil. People ask, well, then why are you using YouTube? Because half the video views in the world are here. They advertise as a global commons that's open to the public, YouTube, it's in the name, and then they get the popularity of the people you know, coming and creating this system, and then now they're slowly taking it over and turning it into a kind of corporate fascist model and where they arbitrarily shut down whoever they want. I mean, I saw a video yesterday where the young turds uh, were saying that they are the number one internet news show. I mean, I'm on over 100 AM and FM stations, XM, but on the internet, just look at my website on Alexa compared to their website. Look at my videos, more views. I mean, you're full of crap. I'm number one in alternative media, period, globally, even Rolling Stone, New York Magazine, all they've done actuaries, I'm number one. And it's not, I'm not even into being number one. I don't even say I'm number one usually. But I'm sick of people that work for Al Gore with his current TV about to go under with absolutely almost no viewers, We're talking like 10,000 viewers at any one time. I mean, what a joke. Uh, saying they're number one. And then getting all the partner channels and all the corporate whore media promoting them. And, and, and uh, I mean, nobody's on YouTube get red carpets rolled out to them, but we're treated like crap and have asked for it and can't even get a partner channel. They won't even give us full hour uploads. We get the 15 minute. We're crap, we're garbage, we're filth, we're trash because we're real and the system's doing everything they can to suppress us. And it's just gonna make me fight that much harder, okay? And, and, and again, as for the young turds, uh, again, I'm not in competition with them, I don't care. 
I, like, I didn't dislike them that much until I saw them in some Al Gore worshiping video and and then and then saw them saying they were the greatest thing on earth and making fun of me for saying the CPS is taking people's kids and then they're like what CPS and then later the head turd uh, learns that um, that his wife's CPS and didn't even know what that meant side issue it's just I'm fighting an uphill battle and winning and then watching people claim that they've got the gold medal when they're way back at the back of the pack and there are a lot of people bigger than young turds and um, I'm just sick of it. I just got up. Sometimes people bitch and complain. That sometimes I do a show, something with my shirt off. It's because I'm real and I don't care. And I'm too lazy to go out there and put a shirt on before I put my jogging outfit on and go for a run. I'm going to be on the radio today talking about this and a lot more. There's a whole cornucopia of censorship going on. The globalists are coming in trying to take the web over and I'm angry. Subscribe to our channel. Let's do a test and see if it even lets you subscribe. And let's see if they start dropping it more every day. Bastards over at YouTube, bunch of globalist scum. Oh, how'd all you traitors feel, all you so-called leftists that made fun of me saying there's no NDAA, no New World Order, no plan for global government, no plan to use the military on the streets, no plan to secretly arrest Americans. I saw the local Chronicle cover story this week, or I guess it was last week, about how NDAA, it came from the White House, was the name of the article. Oh my God, the government's going to arrest us. It's a police state. But nowhere was it Alex Jones is right. Because that damn newspaper has made fun of me hundreds of times saying I'm making this stuff up. It's basically like people making fun of somebody saying Hitler was bad in 1937. You people are going to wish you'd have done more, okay? And all these establishment types acting like they're alternative media, like the young turds and all the rest of it makes me want to throw up with that scumbag Al Gore whose whole TV thing is on the edge of implosion. You people make me sick. That's why you're all going down on the corporate whore media. No matter how much you pose as alternative media, you make me want to throw up. Maggot suckers. Ugh.